Hey, how's it going, everybody? Chris Schmohan here. Uh, no, no intro music on this, on this video. Uh, it, depending on how you're listening to it and what intro music you are particularly used to, because I'm putting this up on uh, multiple different platforms. And uh, if you're watching the video version of this, uh, I'm I'm en route. I'm driving uh, to a place, so. Uh, doing the old classic, classic way of doing this uh, thing. That this is not going to be a super long episode, I guess, or update of uh, of sorts. Um, everything's always kind of changing and moving around, right? That's that's always kind of the thing. Uh, you find a little consistency, and then you kind of go with it, and you hope for a little bit more. Uh, but new things pop up, so you have to kind of shift and change and. Uh, adapt. That's sort of, I think, the big lesson that uh, this whole pandemic is is teaching us is that we we kind of have to adapt um, to the particular situation. And uh, you know, it'd be nice if the fucking government would uh, adapt a little bit and just uh, just do the right thing and run with Medicare for all and do the universal basic income for all American citizens. That would be awesome. But they don't adapt. They don't. They don't like doing that. Anyway, um, I wanted to do a little channel update, a little podcast update, because I'm going to be uh, cha- tweaking up a kind of the release schedule of a bunch of stuff. So you know, you, some of you guys who've kind of been watching this channel for a while, or um, have been tuning into a bunch of my stuff from the get go. Uh, when this pandemic started, I was doing uh, daily videos, daily road reflection videos, and uh, that was a lot. And uh, I liked doing them. They were fun. It was just I'm, I was doing a lot of them. And uh, because I was doing a lot of them, I know I kind of gave myself some stress migraines and shit like that. I uh, wasn't able to concentrate on um, writing or putting together shows and things of that sort and then eventually we got to the point where I was um, able to start doing those zoom shows the citizen revolution shows and then those ended up becoming episodes of forkful of noodles so uh, so then with with taboo table talk I was doing two episodes a week with trying to highlight um, a small business uh, that was affected by the coronavirus, which you can check all those episodes out on the podcast page. They're all up there, Um, you know, different ways that you can help out different businesses, uh, especially if they're in your, in your neighborhood, right? Like I had like Hanover's Church of Satire, um, Greensboro, North Carolina's Idiot Box. Uh, In Pittsburgh, we had Bantha. We had the Pittsburgh Mutual Aid, things of that sort. Like there's a lot, there's about 23 or so interviews up on there um just you know because small businesses weren't getting a lot of attention at the time and I wanted to kind of shed some light on what was going on um in in that world and then I kind of ran out of interviews which that happens you know um, and then I decided that I was going to continue doing the two episodes of Taboo Table Talk a week where I was going to do uh, a one extended dispatch episode and then the regular kind of interview episode that, you know, Taboo Table Talk always does. Uh, and those were going great and those were going fine. But uh, like I said, some things have changed, which means that I'm going to have to scale back the amount of stuff that I'm going to be putting out. Um, And then, obviously, make adjustments accordingly. So, first and foremost, um, I got the side gig, you know, to help with with funds and stuff. So, um, it's short. It's two days a week. But it's still, like, enough that I have to scale back the amount of content that I put out. New relationship, new personal life stuff. Uh, which are all positive. These are all positive things, by the way. This is not like I'm like complaining about these things or anything. These are all pretty positive things that are going on. Uh, so with that said, I couldn't continue to do 
two, pretty much two dispatches. Uh, the interview, you know, put together the interview episode, the road reflections of the weekends, um, and then clip up and put together Forkful of Noodles and maintain my website, and maintain a social media presence, and do all the crazy stuff that I do on a pretty regular basis. Uh, so what does that mean? That that means that, you know, I was putting about six videos up a week, roughly, somewhere around there, maybe f- f- between four and six a week. Um, so I'm going to scale that back. You'll get an episode of Forkful of Noodles every Monday. Um, and the full kind of holistic episodes, the full episodes uh, that... You know, if you're if you're a sustaining member, you get those episodes early. Um, but those full episodes will go up on uh, on Sundays. The the very once once each chunk has been released, the following Sunday they go up. But every Monday will be a fork full of noodles, um, and then on Wednesday, if there's like a clip from the episode, uh, clip from the particular episode. Uh, it'll probably be released Wednesday or Thursday, and then on Friday we'll release the dispatch, um, and uh, Saturday will be the full road reflection, and then clips will be released, you know, later on Saturday and into Sunday. So that's going to kind of be the schedule for right now. We're going back down to one episode of Taboo Table Talk a week, uh, which is going to include a dispatch and the and the regular interview that uh, that I normally do. Um, and then Friday nights, Friday nights is the Citizen Revolution live virtual stand-up comedy show, which you can get tickets for on my website. And uh, so with all of that going on, it's, you know, I, I, I definitely think scaling back is, is a good thing uh, for both my mental and physical health um, because I just, you know, I was getting very stressed out and very burned out. On trying to put out the content that I needed to, uh, uh, you know, the last two weeks, and uh, and that's not good. That's not what I want. I don't want to be stressed out and worked up and fucking. And then you know, I'm, I'm not putting out the quality of material that I would like to put out. Not that I'm saying that I'm I'm not proud of the stuff that I've put out recently. I just think that they could have probably been. Uh, I don't know a little bit more impactful or just better in general. Uh, the other thing I wanted to talk about was my new Rockfin channel. So what's Rockfin? Uh, Rockfin is kind of like Netflix for uh, content creators. Right now there's a lot of political content, there's a lot of wrestling content and MMA content. So if you're a fan of any of those things, you should go check out rockfin.com. And uh, you can you can check out a lot of the free stuff. You can be a free member on there. Uh, but you know, if you become a subscriber, you get all of the premium content that all of uh, Rockfin's content creators release. And then, based on who you choose to follow and how you choose to follow them, uh, the content creators get paid. And uh, you know, so it could be anywhere from like five dollars a subscriber to fifty dollars a subscriber to a hundred dollars a subscriber, and it kind of democratizes content. It, it, you know, you you get to see what you want to see, um, especially if you're kind of sick of YouTube and Facebook uh, and uh, you know their their bullshit censorship. Because I, I mean, I know I am. I'm definitely tired of it. It's uh, it's affected a lot of views and how much you know how often people see my stuff, even if they're a fan of my stuff. And I've talked about that before. It's very frustrating. And so the folks at Hard Lens Media, uh, Kit and Daniel, uh, sent you know referred me to uh, Jaime and. You know, we did. We chatted a little bit about what what my stuff was about and everything, and uh, we got everything set up. And so I kind of filled up the backlog, and now we, I, you know, the channel is caught up. It's up to date. Um, so if you want, if you want to see my stuff, 
and you want to support it, uh, there's a ton of free content on there, but then there's a ton of premium content on there. What's the premium content? The premium content are those full holistic episodes of Forkful of Noodles, the full episodes of Road Reflections, uh, and then I'm going to be putting up, um, you know, the video interviews from Taboo Table Talk that I've uh, gathered from over the last couple months. So I'll be releasing those, uh, you know, periodically. I'll be releasing them as clips. The clips will be free, but the full episodes will be premium content. Um, if you know, if that's not your thing, if you if you don't want to kind of do any sort of freemium thing or you know, it's a, another platform and you don't want to be a part of it, although I highly recommend you check it out because, again, it's, just, it's better than YouTube. And especially if you are, you know, if you're if you're listening to people like like me, Graham Elwood and Ron Placone, Jimmy Dore, um, Kim Iverson, Nico House, Uphill Media with Savage Joy, uh, all of those kind of folks, they're all on that platform. And if you're tired of like, you know, them not showing up on your YouTube feed or them not showing up on your Facebook feed, well, this is this is kind of the way to go. This is kind of the way to do it. Uh, so I highly recommend Rockfin. I highly recommend joining that community. And one of the things I do want to do with the Rockfin community, and I haven't particularly figured out this angle with this new schedule, and maybe I will, right? Maybe the I'll, I'll kind of get into the groove of this schedule and say, hey, you know, I, I kind of have a little extra time on XYZ day at, at 9 p.m., you know, and, and it'll be kind of good to unwind and do do a live stream on Rockfin itself. So I'm going to be doing exclusive premium member um, live streams on Rockfin. I just haven't figured out what day of the week uh, or when I'm going to be able to do it. Uh, but I but I but I am planning on doing that. So so that's another reason to become a premium member uh, on Rockfin. So if you want to follow me on Rockfin, if you want to check out my stuff on Rockfin, like I said, a ton of stuff is going to be available for free. Uh, there's a bunch of stand up stuff on there as well, but I, I'm, I'm going to try to figure out how to downsize some of the like long, like the full stand up specials that I've done. Like my full stand up albums that I've released, like I have videos of them and stuff. Um, and I want to put them up as premium content on, on Rockfin. I want to try to figure out how to downsize some of those things. So those might be going up, um, you know, at a, a, a certain point. Uh, but, you know, go to rockfin.com slash krishmohanhaha. Uh, again, all of the videos uh, will be available right on my website. All the tickets to the Citizen Revolution shows are available on my website, past episodes of the podcast. Uh, all that sort of stuff available right on my website, krishmohanhaha.com. It's K-R-I-S-H-M-O-H-A-N-H-A-H-A.com. Uh, so yeah, so this will be kind of the last of the of the Wednesday Taboo Table Talks for a little while. Um, you know, we'll be going down to releasing one of each show every week. So Forkful of Noodles on Monday. Uh be any additional clips on Wednesday and then uh, Friday is a dispatch Thursday is the full taboo table talk and then Saturday and Sunday are road reflections so um, I hope you guys subscribe I hope you guys are are, are, are you know co- will continue to tune in we'll check out all the new stuff that I'm putting out uh, some of you guys are great with with the comments and discussions uh, so and then there's obviously the people that are kind of uh you know dicks about it and i get exhausted with dealing with that shit (laughs) anyway but that's a that's a tale for another day uh i i wanted to kind of talk about the updates to the channel and everything uh once again the website krishmohanhaha.com uh citizen revolution dates we got august 7th august 14th august 28th and then into september uh i'm gonna be doing those uh, three Fridays out of every month. So three Fridays out of every month. That way it'll give me a little bit of time to take a Friday to kind of recuperate, take a weekend to relax, chill, and, and you know, enjoy some personal time. So I hope you grab tickets. I hope you check out the videos. 
um, and uh, subscribe to the podcast. Check out the Rockfin channel. Do all that fun stuff. Uh, but until until the next one, thanks for tuning in. Stay taboo, and we'll see you on the road. Bye, guys.